Welcome back to University Talk. Today we're talking to students about a new program that is rapidly gaining attention for its ability to transition college graduates to the workplace. This innovative new program is known as You Belong, and here to share her story and give a little bit more insight about You Belong is Elena Garcia. Now, Elena, if I understand, not only if you are an alum who has already landed a great job, mm -hmm. but you're also a mentor now in You Belong. Can you tell us a little bit about that? And thank you for being here. Thank you so much for having me. I'm thrilled for the chance to get to talk about You Belong, a great new program that transitions college seniors into the workplace by teaching them those interpersonal skills that 52% of employers say we're lacking. Wow. Now, Elena, I understand you found you belong as a senior when mm -hmm. you were beginning to think about making that transition from college to career. Can you tell us a little bit about that? Sure. Well, um, I had recently discovered that I had enough credits to graduate with my English degree, but that's pretty much as far as I'd gotten. I'm a first-generation college graduate, so I was thrilled to be earning my degree, but I didn't know what was going to come mm -hmm. next. Um, I didn't know what was going to happen after graduation day, and I didn't know where I could turn for help. Well, that's definitely a scary transition, I think, for anyone. Mm -hmm. So tell us, how did you discover You Belong? It was through a friend, right? Yeah, one of my classmates actually had heard about the program and thought that I would be a good fit, so she referred me to our um, campus career center. Okay. And so there, um, the counselor there was able to get me set up, give me all the information, even show me exactly how to log in and, and start my You Belong account. Great. So you registered for the program. Now give us a run through. What was the process like? Was it difficult to enroll? Oh, not at all. It was very, very simple. All I did was go online, create my profile. I started answering questions uh, about myself to... Um, get a closer look at what my strengths, my weaknesses, and my core values are. And so after that, I was matched with my student group. Oh, so now did you know these students? Oh, no. <laughs> Definitely not. I'd never met any of them before. And we were a really interesting group. There was um, Victor Chenko, Claudio Rivera, and Devin Friedman. And we were all very different. But Victor and I were the most different. How so? Well... He is a biochemical engineer, which is totally not anything I'm interested in. And he's um, a little younger. He's into a rock band. He's um, very take charge and action oriented. Mm -hmm. And I'm, I like to sit at home with my dog and a good book, you know. So we learned to work together. And actually, as the time went on, we found that we actually have very similar values. We have an appreciation for art. We love to give our time and service to others. And we believe strongly in personal development. Well, that's great. Now, you learn to work out your differences just with your, like you have to do in the workplace with mm -hmm. a group. Now, I know that You Belong has been giving you a lot of exercises that you have to complete together. What were these exercises like? Well, when I first heard the term exercises, um, I thought assignments, mm -hmm. boring team assignments. But these were not like that at all. Um, they were very fun, very engaging. Um, we were able to combine our strengths between the group members and figure out that we were complementary in a lot of ways. And each of the activities that we did got us closer to earning a badge, oh. signaling our achievements. And so these achievements all kind of add up to create this employment portfolio that we end the program with. So um, as we were moving through each phase, we had access to professionals mm -hmm. to help us answer um, any questions that we may have or, or give us feedback about our choices. So it was really very engaging. It actually sounds like a lot of fun, too. Mm -hmm. So what is something that you learned about yourself through these exercises that you might have not really realized before? Well, I learned that conflict resolution is actually one of my strengths. Um, my team and I had some silly argument over something, and um, it was actually me who'd stepped in to mediate and to find a quick solution for mm -hmm. us. And it, because of You Belong, I learned that what I was doing was actually called a mediation and I learned that you know there's a value to every interpersonal role within a work group um, no matter what the task at hand is. Nice. Now Elena it sounds like you you belong made your team very close. Oh yeah definitely we became very close a, a really good support network for one another whether or not um, Claudia had lost her cat or Devin had failed his history test we were always there for another using the You Belong app to communicate or Google Hangouts. So whether it was online or in person, we were there when we needed each other. So when the time came for you to venture out into the world of work and interviews, what do you feel that You Belong contributed most that you probably wouldn't have had otherwise? 
Gosh, there was so much. Um, with You Belong, we developed our e-portfolios, and that helped me clearly identify both for myself and employers what my strengths are, mm -hmm. what I could contribute, um, like conflict resolution. Yes. And when I got that first call for my interview, I was not terrified at all, really. I was actually pretty confident because I knew that that e-portfolio we developed was very strong. Nice. So you got the interview and you mm -hmm. weren't nervous at all? Well, maybe just a little <laughs> bit. Um, but when the interviewer started asking me about ethical leadership mm -hmm. and teamwork and decision making and, and written communication, I knew that I'd had experience with all those things Absolutely. because of You Belong. And so it really made all the, the role playing that we did, those group activities, really, really helped me to land that job. That's great. So you said you landed the job, so yeah. you got it. Yeah, I did. Great. Well, um, I'm now a graphic designer for a big public relations company. Awesome. And um, really, like I said, those activities that we did in You Belong in our group work really helped me to feel confident about my abilities and make sure that I had the skills that my employer was looking for. That's great. Elena, your story is just so inspiring. And it's easy to see how beneficial You Belong can be to students who are making that change from being a student to employment and being mm -hmm. an employee. Elena, thank you so much for sharing your story and being here today. Thank you. So why is this important? Because a staggering 52% of students lack the skills and preparation needed to enter the workplace upon graduation. As Elena has demonstrated, with You Belong, students are not just part of the solution, they are the solution. What Elena might not be aware of is You Belong's greatest strength, its self-sustaining open source model, like Linux. One of the last modules she undertook was a group-based critique of an earlier module. The changes they made were fed back to the software and released to all users to optionally incorporate in their college's version. As the participants grow, so do the modules. Elena is now giving back as a mentor, helping new You Belong participants engage their potential.